Hey gamers, welcome back to Joystick News. Today, we're diving into a hot topic that's got everyone buzzing data privacy in gaming. And we're focusing on the latest controversy surrounding once human. Is NetEase really stealing your data or is this just the norm for online games? Let's break it down. So once human just launched and it's already stirring up a storm, Besides the usual gripes about gameplay and optimization, there's a lot of chatter about its terms of service. And let me tell you, it's raising some eyebrows. The game's privacy policy mentions collecting everything from your name and email to your location, and even government-issued IDs. Yep, you heard that right passport information. Now, NetEase, the developers behind Once Human, have tried to reassure players. They say they only collect IDs when absolutely necessary, like verifying a parent's permission for a child to play, and they promise this info is deleted right after it's used. But still, it's a lot of data. Here's the thing, the once human isn't alone in this. If you dig into the privacy policies of other big games like Diablo 4 or World of Warcraft, you'll find similar clauses. The internet today is like a gold mine for data and almost every company is digging in. But does that mean we should just accept it? Absolutely not. Players have every right to be concerned about how their data is being used. Companies need to be transparent and accountable. It's not just a NetEase problem, it's an issue across the board. So what can you do to protect yourself? First, always read the terms of service. I know, I know, it's long and boring, but it's important. You can also use tools like the Terms of Service, didn't read browser extension to get a quick overview of what you're agreeing to. And if a game's data practices seem too invasive, maybe it's not worth your time or money. In the end, we need to keep the pressure on these companies to do better. As gamers, we deserve to enjoy our favorite games without sacrificing our privacy. What do you think? Are you concerned about data privacy in gaming? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching and don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell for more gaming news and discussions. Stay safe and game on!